everyone welcome once again to my channel this is intuitive edge thanks for joining me it's time to take a look at our week ahead so stay tuned and we'll look at the cards I'll be right back and we'll get started what I'm sensing about this week is that things dealing with cargo supply chain are going to still continue to be an issue um, I did feel something about a container a shipment and what I was seeing specifically was a wooden box that was being shipped I believe across country and I don't know if the origin or the destination but I got I think it's somewhere around Ohio perhaps Ohio and Indiana border and there's something important in a wooden box, and I believe this is by airplane. Now, the wooden box, it kind of surprised me because generally wooden boxes are kind of heavy, and I wouldn't expect it to be on an airplane, but that's what I saw, um, like in a, in a cargo bin, an overhead cargo bin. Generally, I would think those would be checked baggage that would be in the cargo hold underneath but for some reason I saw it on the actual passenger area of the plane itself but I see this wooden box and there's something special about it I'm not sure exactly what I've tried to kind of tune into it um, as far as the contents I don't really see anything maybe some clothes but I'm getting something special about the box maybe it's Maybe it's really old, maybe it's antique, but there's some type of value or specialness about this box. And why I keep getting shown this box, um, uh, I sat down to do the video and I was seeing these things in my mind's eye. Um, I got interrupted, had to leave for a few minutes, came back. I thought I'll start fresh and then this pops up again. This vision keeps coming to me. So it must mean something, this cargo box. Um, but in general, we have cargo containers, shipment, docks, perhaps inspectors, luggage, carry-on luggage. Those are all going to play out big this week. And the airplane cargo bin, looking at my notes here, was a brown box or trunk. Um, so I do think there will be more supply chain disruptions this week and people may be looking for creative ideas to get things delivered. So we'll look for maybe drones or some type of creative ideas um, that there's gonna be some talking around what can we do to ease the port situation and get goods moving again. So look for that. And as to the wooden cargo box and what connection it has to the Ohio Indiana line or somewhere around that geographically, I actually got my little map out and was trying to feel where that was and that's, that's kind of the area I felt. I don't know and I'm hoping this doesn't ha um, have to do with a, a, a traffic air incident like a plane crash I'm hoping that's not what I'm seeing um, and what that has to do with this special box that has something to do with maps I almost see this box having like hieroglyphs in it or some type of inscription on the inside of the box itself like the box itself is has value or meaning so again I Maybe I'll get more insight on it. If I do, I'll put it in this video or I'll do a subsequent video if I get more information. But that's, it's, it's sticking with me and that's what I'm seeing for now. So, all right, we'll stay tuned on that, okay. So tuning into the political energies this week, I have the Four of Pentacles on that. Um, now I'm tuning into the artwork and what I'm seeing with this card. It's generally a card about security, uh, keeping things secure, being territorial. Um, I'm kind of sensing the 
people being kind of in a, a squeeze politically. And there's some vacillation between... Um, it's like two different worlds are warring this week in, for the minds and the hearts of the people. Look for a disconnect this week politically. More disconnect between heart and head. People that know what's going on and people that are still processing internally what's happening politically. There, there's, I just see a disconnect between the two. I think the divide is going to continue to widen um, that intentional design that is dividing the people into separate camps. Also politically, I see a stall or some indecision coming in and society, um, the card for that was the Knight of Swords and it was facing right back into the political and that Knight of Swords is a card of taking action. So there may be some people that are deciding to take action maybe where they perceive governments as being soft on the issues or indecisive or not or vacillating um there's there's a challenge being presented with some of that vacillating that i saw going on and some people may decide to rise up and take action in areas that they uh feel there is a void of leadership okay um also for earth uh i got the eight of swords on that there could be some earth changes happening this week that might be unpleasant but i also sense that there could possibly be a build up of energy so i think that there may be something building that could erupt later on um maybe a, a, at a later date but there's there's a pressure building of some kind within the earth and i'm not sure where exactly this is it could be in several places but i do sense a building of the earth's energy at various points so we could see volcanoes perhaps pop off maybe in the coming weeks um but right now there's like the pressure is is gathering force and gathering steam okay uh earth uh let's see earth was restriction pent-up energy now on the business front look for there to be rumors of new things that may be starting on the business front perhaps news of a merger or of just new things in business new strategies coming up new business ideas something in that sector is going to be talked about but things are kind of in the rumor stage right now and we may not see what new things are coming out but there are some new things brewing on the business front um, so look for that as well but right now it's in the rumor stage okay um, hidden we have hidden influence we have the endings card the ten of swords things being over things being final um, so perhaps that could be related to business with things finalizing and being done but yet not yet announced to the public so that could be that new thing in the business sector I was seeing and perhaps that will be coming out once things are official so right now things are in the rumor mill in the rumor stage um, now I do think we could have some difficult events this week uh, we have the heartache card coming up again I'm hoping I didn't see a, a plane crash that would certainly be a sad event if there was something like that um, so but there could be some type of difficulty or challenge emotionally this week i think we'll have an okay week and there's there's just some unsettled energy that's both building within the earth and politically if things stall there may be people that take matters into their own hands 
Um, so culmination is the fool card, things beginning anew, starting over. So um, I, I think there could be some good energies coming through as well. So overall, I think we're gonna have an okay week. And um, that's all I have for now. And if I get any more insight on what that box is about, um, and if any of you happen to hear anything that lets me know what it's about, sometimes um, things come up in my readings and I don't always get every single piece of news that comes out. So if you see something that fits, let me know in the comments. All right, I appreciate it, everybody. We'll catch you next time. This has been Intuitive Edge. Have a great week. Bye for now.